Are you waiting by the food bowl? Is it time for breakfast? I think it is. What's up guys? We are filling up the diesel heater that Tracy Ocean's Fire sent me. Thank you Tracy so much. It set right in just like my other one did. Thank you so much. We're going to fill it up. Fire it up. Alright. Little bit more maybe. Awesome. Tighten the lid up. And fire this puppy up. There we go. Takes a minute to fire up. All right. I hear the pump, the fuel pump going. It's, it starts up. It starts up really loud, they do. So. Here we go. Oh, yeah. That's getting really hot already. That's awesome. Now we'll turn it down a little bit. There we go. All right, see how it slows down? You can hear it slow down. Awesome. Wiping everything down. Tomorrow I go into the campground close to town because uh, I'll be babysitting. But today I'm just cleaning and wiping things down. Tomorrow I'll set all this stuff in the sink when I get ready to drive and uh, that way it don't fall around anywhere. But I usually try to get the house all cleaned up before we go driving. Now we're gonna go do some laundry. Hey, you guys better get out of that washing machine. It's gonna get wet in there. I think it's warm enough to put the kitties outside, uncover their tent, and get them going. gonna come outside I had to come around to this side and get you are you coming out doc nope how about you you ready to come out I think so hey okay, we got four out doc didn't seem like he wanted to come out I'll go check again you ready yet are you ready I just don't think he wants out today what a beautiful day today I can't film the bike ride because I didn't bring my tripod thing I put on the handlebars, but what a nice day. I stopped to look at the cattle and just enjoy the view. Boy, I wish we had some more snowpack on top of those mountains. Uh, Oregon is one of the states in a drought, even though we've had a lot of rain. We're still not doing good with the rain. All right, I'm going to get off here and keep pedaling stop again and take another view i just love this part of the country it's just so green and beautiful if you guys have never been to oregon and you get a chance to come here you should i'll see if i can hold the bike while i pedal back towards the van and we'll just ride along together here I don't think I can hold it long, but we'll give it a shot. <laughs> There's usually a llama right here in this field, but he's not out here today. I don't see him. <sighs> I 
I just love this part of the country, I tell you. I was born and raised in Oklahoma. And uh, I was so used to flatlands. And when I moved here to Oregon, I was just amazed. I just love the mountains. Uh-oh. Better get on the right side of the road here for now. I usually stop here and uh, look at the chickens in that chicken coop right there, but I guess they got rid of them. This belongs to um, an herb farm out here, but they have chickens. They did have chickens, but I guess they got rid of them. All right, I'm gonna get off here and get back to the van. What's going on, everybody? What a beautiful day it is here in Southern Oregon. I think we're about up to almost 80 degrees today. It's supposed to be 82 tomorrow. That's perfect. Getting still chilly at night though. Um, but then day after tomorrow, it's going to turn back to the high of 55 or 60. So summer's almost here, but not quite yet. Uh, it'll be pretty warm in June at the meetup though, uh, for sure. It'll be cooler in the area where we're going to be at because it's a higher elevation, but it starts warming up about then, uh, in this area. But, uh, yeah, so today's been, uh, relatively not crazy, nothing going on. Um, I want to thank, uh, Tracy Oceans Fire 777, thank you for the diesel heater. Much appreciated. And uh, I am I just talked to my mechanic. He is probably going to help me install the other diesel heater that I have that's not like this one um, to where it will fit or where I can put it. It, it needs to go on the floor because there's going to have to be holes drilled in the bottom of the van. And so this summer um, when we're doing some stuff to the van, he's going to help me do it. And that way I'll have that as a backup heater and this one here. Plus I have now uh, two fuel filter or two uh, glow plugs on backup. So, hey, we are prepared. Uh, but again, thank you, Tracy. Uh, that was wonderful what you did. And, and I can't say into words what it means to me. Thank you so much. Um, let's see. Not going to stay on here much longer. I have to get done and get cleaned up. I'm going to be on Johnny's Journey tonight. You guys won't see this video till tomorrow, but I'm going to be on Johnny's Journey tonight. And uh, so it should be a lot of fun. Uh, I always have fun over at Johnny's. And if you guys don't know Johnny's Journey, go check her out. Um, super cool lady, a nurse that has converted her van and now she has a business that um, she uh, uh, does van conversions for people, van builds. Um, so yeah, uh, Johnny's journey, you guys go check her out. I think for dinner tonight, I'm going to, I have some brisket that I had bought down at the barbecue and I'm going to make me a, a brisket sandwich, I think for dinner and have a salad. So a sandwich and salad for dinner tonight, nothing special. Um, and be ready for Johnny's journey. All right, guys, take care of yourselves take care of each other. Peace out.